Hey everyone, what's up? This is Blaze, and welcome to another Wizard101 update video. So, Chrysalis finally came out today in the live realm, so a lot of people are really excited for that. Uh, so am I, but I haven't been able to jump into it and record yet because I'm still waiting for Blue. But in the meantime, they have released some new Crowns update stuff that we can look at before then. So, um, on the launch, they actually said that they released some new Crowns items into the Crown Shop, and here they are right on the front page. So the first thing that we see here is going to be this new Stonehopper permanent mount, which honestly looks pretty cool. There's one that's kind of like that that we saw in the Amber Estate that's uh, two-person and it's also flying. So this one, uh, it'd be cool to see how this one actually walks if it hops or what. I mean, it's called a Stonehopper, so I would kind of assume it would like hop a little bit. But that is the new uh, Stonehopper permanent mount. That's 5,000 crowns. And I, I, I don't have enough for it. So, uh, other thing, this is a pet. The brown or the bronze golem is a myth, a new myth pet that is an incredible 10k crowns. So a lot of uh, crowns there if you're gonna buy this pet. But it does have some cool talents, and it also gives that bronze armor card, which is new that we haven't seen. So it's four pips for myth, and uh, it'll allow you to absorb 500 damage. Um, I know from uh, Alexander Lionheart that this pet has some cool may cast talents like may cast spirit shield and i think may cast myth fuel so it's a new myth pet and it is now in the crown shop so you can go look at that the other new pet is going to be the tarantula hawk which is uh i assume fire because it gives the brimstone a revenant uh, i'm not sure of this uh pet's talents yet because i haven't really looked at it but it is also there it's less expensive than the bronze golem so i would assume it doesn't have quite as good talents but uh, there it is. It has the you know the chrysalis feel to it with the awesome insect form. It looks really cool. I like its uh, arms or whatever you call it. I was about to say tentacles, but no, those aren't tentacles. I like its arms or appendages. <laughs> so uh, that's one of the cool new pets. I'd like to see that pet. Uh, someone have that pet because it, lo it would look. I think it looked cool flying next to you. Um, so yeah. Those are the two new pets. Uh, there's also some uh, new gear here. Uh, we have this Valiant Attire, which looks like, I don't know, it kind of looks like some kind of deer. You have, like, deer antlers on the top there. And uh, it's called, uh, well, the head's called the Paladin's Mantle, the Valid Valiant Paladin's Armor, and the Boots of Paladin's Valor. So that is a new set that they've introduced. I don't know. I would assume people would just kind of go for this, maybe for the looks, because it, it looks really cool. But it does have a pretty good resist on all the stuff. So, uh, that's the new armor set. Staff of the Sub Subjugator is also new. And it has a pretty good amount of incoming and outgoing heals. And then 8% um, power pips. That's pretty good. But uh, no pierce on it. So, that is a new wand there. It looks really cool. I like I like the look of it. And uh, so, it's a new staff. Uh, we also have a new uh, baton. Swarm Commander's baton. And you can't even see it because all the all the text is uh, blocking it. But there it is. And this thing has a pretty good block or a pretty good crit. I mean, that has also the 8% uh, power pips and it also has some pierce there. So that's new. Uh, these new plant, uh, the new plant is going to be this Sunyan, which is uh, seems to be like kind of a mid-ranged uh, plant in terms of the rewards and stuff. How much is this compared to... Oh, the Magma Peats are over 1,000, I know. I think they're like 1,150. So, it's less expensive than that. But, it'd be kind of interesting to see what kind of rewards this uh, new Sunyan gives. But yeah, those are going to be some of the new items in the Crown Shop that they've just released today. With the new update of Chrysalis. So, pretty cool stuff. Uh, lots more videos and all that stuff to come. Um, I want to know if you guys would like to see some new pet showcases for these new pets because obviously i had to buy crowns in order to get these but if you want to go ahead and comment and tell me or maybe i'll just do one of them if you want so tell me which one if you want me to do a pet showcase on either of those and uh yeah that's pretty much gonna wrap it up we will be doing uh we'll, we'll be starting our road to 95 series soon once we're able to start recording that so definitely look forward to that uh soon probably this weekend but uh yeah, so thank you guys for watching this quick update video on some of the new stuff in Chrysalis, and stay tuned for more awesome videos in the future. So, I'll see you guys next time.